would, um, that would be his nervous tick. He'd have like headphones on and he would get major like feedback and all of us would be like, Puck. the best one was we had this on, um, on a song on the, the boy with no name called, um, what's it called? Um, Colder. We had a harp player. This beautiful big harp and this girl and she was total classical music woman. She was like, da -da -da -da. <laughs> and uh, Steve was like, oh, put your headphones on and we were all like, oh fuck man, he's going to kill our ears. He's like, shoot. And so she put these headphones on and we were all like, and none of us noticed that the, the, the talk bag, which is the mic you speak to her in the studio, there's a pair of headphones right next to it, which is just a recipe for the, the, the loudest possible feedback you can get. So as soon as you press the talk back button, I mean, I think people on the street outside heard it, and it was like, Bleh! I've never seen this, such a calm girl went fucking with the headphones. <laughs> and she looked like sick, she was nearly sick, it was so loud. Anyway, I hope none of you have damaged ears after that. <laughs> if you do, then you can all come in and talk to Saul after the gig. He's looking really forlorn now inside this stage. Oh, come on, Saul, it's not the end of the world. Come on, Saul.